Hi everybody, welcome and welcome back to the channel. Hope you are all doing okay. Um, today's video is an unboxing video of a kit from Diamond Art Club. Um, before I start, I would just like to say that I'm not well at the moment, so I, I'm sorry for the lack of videos in the last week. Um, I do like to try and put one up at least once a week, but I've been so poorly with this cough, flu virus, whatever it is I've got. Um, so I really do apologise for that. Um, I will try not to cough during the videos, but yeah. So yes, welcome on in. And if you are new to the channel, if you would be willing to subscribe, that would be amazing. Um, but thank you for joining me anyway. And thank you to those of you coming back to me. Today's video, as I say, is an unboxing of a kit from Diamond Art Club. Now, I've had my eye on this since it was released and I did order it pretty quickly after release. I've had this for a while waiting to be unboxed. So, yeah, really, really looking forward to having a look at this with you today. So, let's dig in. I'm just going to get rid of the outer box. Which one of the cats will probably dive straight into? Lola, I'm guessing. And the kit I have today is a square diamond painting, as you will see from the square line there and the square shape on there. And it is called Sugar High and it is by the very wonderful Lizzie Falcon. I absolutely love this image so much. Um, but yeah, just a quick tour of their box. So yeah, it's a branded box. Um, on the side of the box, we have a scan me discount code. On the back of the box, there are instructions of what's included and how to diamond paint. So let's dig in. I should have got some scissors handy and I didn't. So to get in the cellophane. So how are you all doing? Are you all doing okay? I'm currently on half term break from school. Uh, I was off last week and this is my second week off and it's Wednesday today. Um, and yeah, I've spent the whole uh, holiday so far feeling really poorly. So yeah, not great, but at least it didn't mean, you know, having to have time off work feeling poorly. So yeah, that's a plus side of it, I guess. So yeah, what do you think? I'm also really sorry about the lighting. It is dreadful. I bought in an extra light to try and sort of counteract how dull of an evening and this room is super dark tonight. So yeah, I do apologise about that. But yeah, isn't she absolutely stunning? I cannot wait to actually have a look at her. So excited for this one. I've got another one that arrived as well a few days ago that I am super excited to unbox. So yeah, I cannot wait to show you that one as well. So inside our branded box we have the kit which comes in a branded dustproof bag we also have a sticker you can do what you like with a sticker some people use it for log books uh, me personally i stick it on the bottom um, of the box because i store mine that way and i can see exactly what's in them so that's what i do with that but you can do obviously what you want to do with it we also get a tool kit um, now, the toolkit contents, as they are at the moment, are apparently going to change. But, you know, currently this is what we, we are getting in the kits. Um, it tells you on the back of the pouch what is in there. Um, so we have um, a pen, um, a comfort grip for the pen, some wax in a container, a tray, a tray stopper, a couple of multi-placers, a cover minder, washi tape, some zip zip lock baggies and tweezers um if it was a round kit you wouldn't get the tweezers that we do with a square kit so let's have a look at our tool kit okay so yeah we have a selection of bags we also have a four placer and a seven placer now, these are the quite thin ones so for plastic placers these are really good ones we get a heart-shaped pot of wax and inside there we have two plates of wax. Uh, these do have a covering on them like a protective film so if you're going to use them you need to lift that film up, she says, if she can get hold of it. You need to lift the film up before you try and put your pen into it. I've cut down all my nails. I used to have really long nails but I've had to cut them down due to work so yeah. I'm now struggling with this. I don't actually use the wax, to be honest. I use um, putty, but yeah, that feels thicker than normal. So I don't know if they've made changes to that, but yeah, 
that is the wax you pull that up i keep if you're using you're going to use the wax try and keep it this in place and just you know take it up to put your pen in then put it back down just keeps it cleaner and fresher so yeah and you've got the little pot there to put that in but as i say i use putty from um crafting cat uk on etsy so i don't tend to use the wax but if you do use the wax that comes with kits that is a really good quality wax we get a pen that has a pen grip um if you don't know what those are and you haven't seen them before that's just the you slide that onto the pen and it makes it more comfortable to hold again i prefer to use my own pens um these are a little bit thin for me but you know as as a toolkit goes this is an excellent toolkit and you've got everything in here you could possibly need to start a diamond painting if you've never done one before the pen and grip are always color coordinated if you order this exact same kit you may not necessarily get this pen and grip color but they will match so whatever comes in yours the pen and grip will match each other we also have a very sweet little cover minder now if you don't know what a cover minder is that has a magnet on the back and a second magnet and you can use that to hold your cellophane down whilst you're working on your diamond painting so yeah that's the cover minder we also have a pair of branded tweezers and they have a shield on them because they are sharp so just make sure you put that back on just to keep yourself safe we have a tray and that is our tray stopper so when you shake your drills they won't all fly out everywhere and then we have some very pretty washi tape so yeah that is lovely i think i think the cover minder is one of the things that's being debated to be changed um, but i'm not sure what else if there's going to be anything in place or if they're just taking it out or you know what exactly changes they are making i am not sure at this stage um, i heard about it some time ago but it's not happened as yet so who knows so yeah here we go here is our canvas and it has as i say a dust proof bag on there to keep that all nice and clean let's get that open And it's a beautiful soft canvas, a tarpaulin canvas. Um, this is trademarked to them, this type of canvas. So, so yeah, let's actually let's tip the drills out first. So that is a heavy bag of drills. <laughs> right, let's just show you these bits as well. Inside your kit, you get a thank you for your purchase leaflet. Uh, this is a really handy leaflet, actually. It tells you what's included in the kit. Uh, you also get some tips and tricks and another discount code there. Um, you also get details of, you know, step by step instructions of how to diamond paint. They also have a VIP Facebook groups. Once you've made a purchase, you can join the VIP group. Fantastic group. You get to see what's coming up. You get to vote on what what kits you'd like to see coming up as well. So it's a really good group to join. Step by step instructions there. And on the back, we also have yet another discount code. So if you download their app and make your first purchase on the app, you will get 20% off your first purchase. So yeah, we also get a sticker sheet, which is really handy for kitting up. But yeah, look at her, isn't she? Absolutely beautiful. Look at his tattoos. Sorry if you can hear the noise in the background. That is now Lola getting into the empty box. So yeah, we have 61 colours in total on this one. We have, let's have a look, one, two, four AB. So if you look at the top here at the beginning, any number under 150 will be an AB. So 100, 128, 131 and 141 are all AB. So yeah, we have four ABs. And if you go to the end here, these ones with a Z in front of them, they are our fairy dust drills. And if you've seen any of my videos before, you will know that I'm absolutely crazy about fairy dust drills. So yeah, I absolutely love them so much. So this is our bag of drills, which I'll get to in a minute. Also on the bag, we have um, the details of what kit is in here. So if you do store your drills separate to your canvases, um, you will be able to sort of match them up easily. So let's have a look at her. I'm actually going to roll her the other way. Um, they do have lie flat technology um, with their diamond paintings anyway. So she should pretty much lie flat anyway. But just to make it that little bit quicker, I will just roll her the other way. She's absolutely beautiful. She's pretty huge as well. I mean, I knew the size obviously before I ordered, but she just seems, it just seems like a really big kit. Oh, 
sorry about that, I've just knocked you flying. Let me just readjust you. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah, as I say, she's literally, she covers my entire table and some. So yeah, but I will give you a pan over her um, shortly. But yeah, she's absolutely beautiful. Just look at those boobs there, look, with a, with a tie on her neck and those tattoos. She's absolutely stunning. I'm presuming that's uh, blood on her knee there. But yeah, she's got nice bright red pants on and lots of tattoos. Gosh, she's absolutely stunning. I absolutely love her. I mean, just look at her face. She does look very sad. But yeah, you know, her makeup's all sort of smudged and dark. So like she's been crying. So yeah, quite a sad image, but a very stunning image. Yeah, she's very beautiful. Wow, I love her. Absolutely love her. I'll give you a pan over shortly, but yeah, just to let you know, um, the um, it's a scalloped edge, so it won't, you know, sort of fray or anything. We have their branding along the top, the Do What Makes You Sparkle. We have a schematic or colour list or chart, whatever you want to call it, down the left-hand side. And we also have it on the right-hand side, which is right down here at the bottom. And... Yeah, along the bottom of the canvas here, it actually tells you the size of the canvas. This is a 50.8 by 103.8. It tells you that it's a Lizzie Falcon art with diamond art club. So basically what that means is this is branded, th sorry, this is licensed um, artwork. So this artist will be paid for her work basically. Um, so yeah, it's a, it, this is a huge canvas. <laughs> Along the middle bit there, they um, have their social details telling you to share your masterpiece, etc. Um, and then along this section here is the warranty that you get a lifetime warranty with their canvases. That's if you buy from them direct. If you purchase from um, like a D-Stash group, for instance, you don't get that. Um, that's voided. So, but yeah, this one is also one of their... I'm going to try and show this to you, but basically... They have changed their film over it so that it is in sections. Now, I hope you can see that just in that light. But basically, a lot of people use what we call release papers to section their canvas. But Diamond Art Club have actually changed there so that this, it is actually sectioned for you, which I think is a game changer. I think that's a really, really good idea, personally. I absolutely love that idea because when I put my release papers on, you know, I can't see the canvas underneath and to be able to still see it all whilst I'm working away, I think is definitely a game changer for me. I've not actually worked on one of them yet with these new um, sort of perforated um, cellophane. So, yeah, um, I am looking forward to that. And the last couple I think I've received are like that. But I'm currently working on um, a Diamond Dark Club one at the moment, which is an older style canvas and it doesn't have that. But, yeah. That is an absolute game changer for me. I absolutely love that. But yes, let's have a look at these drills. Wow, these, this bag of drills is so heavy. Sorry about the plastic sound. I know a lot of you do not like that noise. I'm just going to do a quick run through of the drills because I don't want to bore people who aren't interested in the colour list. So if you do want to, you know, sort of rush through, speed me up, whatever you want to do, that's absolutely fine. I understand so we've got uh, 3688, 208, 718. So they're sort of fairly small numbers. We have, I guess quite a few strips of drills by the looks of them. We have 741, 318, another 318. 380, 3801, we have a couple of bags. 154, we have a couple. 814, we have one. 3834, 317, 3706, 519, 498, and there is a stowaway in there. 498 again, 762, 762 again, 892, a couple of 817s there. Next ones we have, oh now we have quite a lot of 310 in this one because there's a lot in the background, so yeah. <laughs> And also the 3865, we've got quite a lot of, but obviously that's all of her skin is going to be predominantly this colour. But yeah, we've got 3865, we've got one, two, three, four of those. And three tens, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
nine bags of three tens, not one of my favourite colours to place, but yeah, three tens quite often tend to have trash in, um, or more trash than regular drill, you know, regular other colours do, but to be fair, since Diamond Art Club made all their upgrades to their canvases and drills, I've not really had hardly any trash in any of the kits I've done recently, so I'm not worried about that. So yeah, 415, we have a couple, 3708, 666, we have three of, 817, not seen any specials yet, we have 3855, 921, 699, 701, 3823, 898, 340, 350, 819, 210, 3809, 3846, 100, here's our first AP. So yeah, it's like a beautiful, like a pale green. If you don't know what an AB drill is, AB stands for Aurora Borealis, which is basically like the Northern Lights. It's got an extra coating on it to make it shine a little bit differently and a little bit brighter. 996, 3776, 3853, 3854, 745, 3608 and 995. And then on this lot we have, this is the last set of drills, we have 433, 327, 3760, 743, 3746, 597, 141, that's another of our AB drills. So yeah, I like that one. 333, 3799, oh, Z3. 607, which is one of our fairy dust drills. Now, these are so hard to show you um, on a video because it's really difficult. Because the, because it's so subtle, it basically is like a glitter coating on top of the drill. Um, it's not like an AB where it's like on top of the drill. This is actually incorporated into the drill, um, you know, so the glitter doesn't come off like on your on your clothes, on anything really, like on your hands, whatever, it's just, it's incorporated in. So sometimes with ABs, I find them a little bit tricky when I'm placing them because they want to stick to the to the wax and the putty and things like that. But um, these just, you place them like normal drills, basically, but they do have that extra bit of something. <laughs> but yeah, fairy dust drills are literally my absolute favourite special drill. I'm trying so hard so that you can see that, but... It's really difficult. But that's one of our fairy dust. We've got 775, 434, 128. So here we are with another AB drill. So that's a pink AB, which is lovely. 947. Oh, look at this one. Z3837. Now, can you get that? I hope you can because that is super, super pretty. That's going to look stunning on this canvas. 131, there's another AB here. Yeah, I, lo I love yellow ABs. They they just, they're so bright. 740, 38, sorry, 3687, 413 and 3803. So let me just have a look along the canvas so we can work out where our... Where our ABs are and where our fairy dust are. So let's have a look. AB number one, which is the that pale green one. That is a number one. So yeah, that is in it's in her earring. Um there wasn't many of that one, I don't think, was there? So I don't think there's gonna be huge amounts, but it's gonna be used um in little bits of a hair, you know, sort of in these colour strips in a hair. That's where that's gonna be. So other than the earring. Um, and in some some places in her tattoos, like it's in this one here, it's going to be used in the hair. I would say mainly like there's some there as well, I can see. So, yeah, that's where one of our ABs is. We have a number two, which is a pink one. That, again, I can see in bits of her hair. And it's probably going to be in, yeah, in some of her tattoos as well. So in the hair, in the tattoos... Yeah, and down here, look, I can see that one in there as well. So, yeah, being really well used to sort of make those colours pop. Let's have a look at the next one. It is number three, which is a yellowy 
maybe where are you number three yeah again in these lines in her hair all along there look is the number three one so yeah they are going to really nicely stand out and um one for one is the other a b which is a number four now where are you going to pop out number four ah <laughs> round the heart tattoo and in this tattoo here so yeah again to make things stand out and again in this one here that's where they are let's have a look for our fairy dust so we have a squiggle kind of like this one here look these are our two fairy dust we have that squiggly one and uh, i always think of that as like a sun timer so let's have a look for those i'm guessing there's probably going to be in her hair as well let's have a look. Oh, i can see some there in her hair Yeah, where are you? Squiggles. Uh, one of them's down here. So yeah. Oh, right. Okay. A lot of one of them is in there. The other one's probably some of it in there as well. Let's have a look. Oh, in the tattoos again. So in this heart tattoo up this bit here. Yeah, and possibly in the hair as well, I'm assuming. Yeah, definitely some bits in the hair. This bit here is all... Um, this lilac colour there is, a, is the, one of the fairy dust drills. So, yeah, she is going to look absolutely beautiful. What do you think, guys? Have any of you ordered this one or is she on your wish list? I love the way the tie is very <laughs> well placed, shall we say. But, yeah, she is absolutely beautiful. I do actually really love this artist's work anyway. So, yeah, I it's just absolutely gorgeous. It's just so long, though. It's like unbelievably long. It's literally... It sticks off the, I mean, this is a massive table. This is a massive dining table and it sticks over the end on both sides. So yeah, <laughs> it is super long. So yeah, let me just do a bit of a pan over for you, um, starting sort of from the top. So yeah, we've got, uh, you know, as I say, a lot of um, three tens will be in. I mean, to be fair, the three tens are here, I'm presuming. Let's have a look. Three tons, yeah. And then it changes for this out a bit here. So, you know, is, is me thinking that a lot of the, you know, that all the out of it is going to be the three tens. It's actually not. It's like literally round to about there and then it changes for this bit. So that's going to be really nice to work. Um, and it's also going to give some colour blocking chance as well all the way through this one. Like, especially when you, when you get down to a face and you'll see what I mean. But like, even in the hair, in the hair, you'll be able to get some, um, you know, multi-placing in, which I definitely need practice with, let's just say. So, yeah, look. Look at her sad-looking eye. I wonder if that's like a little tear in her makeup, maybe. But, yeah, she's absolutely beautiful. She's just absolutely stunning. I just cannot believe how long she is. Might have to... She might have to go on the bedroom wall, I think. I'll be quite happy looking at her every night. Not going to lie. She's beautiful, isn't she? I love the shading as well with her legs and stuff and round her hands. She's, she's going to look absolutely beautiful. I've not seen anyone complete her yet. I, have, I don't even know if I've seen her unboxed, actually, but she must have been a sneak peek for someone. I've obviously just forgotten. I do look out for the sneak peeks all the time from Diamond Dark Club, so I must have seen her. But yeah, just look at these tattoos. They're just gorgeous, aren't they? Look at these. Are they forget-me-nots? They look like forget-me-nots to me, but they're, they're, on, they're not the right colour, though, are they? Maybe they're not. I don't know. They look forget-me-not shape. One of you green-fingered people will tell me I'm not good on plants and flowers. Unless it's something obvious like a rose or a carnation. I'm, yeah, I'm not the best. But what do you think, guys? She's just absolutely beautiful. I absolutely love this. This canvas just looks, symbols are just so crystal clear. It's absolutely beautiful. Let me just bring the canvas up actually for you to have a closer look. But yeah, as you can see, I'll pull that back a little bit for you. She, I mean, this super sticky as well, but yeah. Look how clear and beautiful those symbols are. 
absolute dream to work on. And yeah, I, I, I mean, Diamond Art Club, I, if anyone watches my videos from Diamond Art Club, this is, I love this perforated film. It is just fantastic. Yeah, I do. She's just adorable. A big hoop earring. Look at her hair, all those colours in her hair. She's, can you imagine? She's just going to look absolutely glorious, isn't she? She's just going to be superb. But yeah, so down this bit here, the 310 is all, that is all 310. So it looks like they've just kind of done the shading bit at the top. And then as you go down the sides and obviously down the sides here and down this bit here, they are all 310. So that's going to be like a multi-placing heaven section that is, isn't it? Definitely get the multi-placer out on that one. I need to get more prepped with the multi-placing then and get a bit braver. I get to like... I don't know, seven or eight. And then I think, yeah, I'm going to try the 10. And I do it for about two goes. And I'm like, no, I just, I, mm. I always feel a bit like I'm going to do it wrong or something. So yeah, I am. I do need to get on with it and just have a go. But yeah, she's just, tell me what you think in the comments. Is she for you or is she a, just a not on your, not on your radar or is she a, yeah, I definitely need to get her. But yeah, she's, she is glorious. Absolutely stunning lover love 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 so yes thank you very much for joining me today and uh, uh, and again sorry about the husky voice uh, a bit bonnie tylerish today so yeah um thank you for joining me and if you would be willing to subscribe that would be very much appreciated and i will see you guys in the next video take care goodbye for now